Hey guys, Gator Mom here. Happy Friday. I'm doing a quick review for you today on the MZ Wallace Samal Metro Bag. The color is papaya on this one. And I'm getting ready to run out actually for an afternoon with the kids. So I thought I would really quickly, hopefully I'm not interrupted <laughs> since I have all three of them home with me this summer. And so it's been super fun and really crazy and chaotic. Um, so I apologize if I'm slow on the videos in the coming weeks, but I don't get much time um, to myself to record. So like I said, this one is going to be a super quick video. I want to show you how I have it packed up, all the fun um, jujube accessories I have in here and everything that I pack in them. I want to give you kind of a view of the front of the bag and a side angle so you can see um, kind of the way that it's structured, I guess you could say. It is um, a really, really cute bag. I like it a lot. Um, I've been carrying it for a little while now, actually. I've been going into backpack mode a lot this summer with having all three kids but this one is just really easy it's comfortable the straps on it are really short so you kind of throw it over your forearm you cannot fit this underneath your arm it does not have a messenger strap option so it's really just kind of a grab and go tote for me but it holds a lot without being completely massive so I really like that about it um, the cute little MZ Wallace plaque there is on the bag there's no outside pockets no side pockets it's literally just an open top tote. And then the bottom of it, if I, anything falls out there, has the little um, cute feet there also. So kind of gives it a little something so the bag doesn't sit completely on the floor. The bag does zip the whole way across. I actually already have it unzipped since I'm one-handed with the camera today. I didn't want to be fumbling with the zipper. Attached here on this outside handle, I have my Jujube CMO Passy Pod with my sweet little Donatello like character on there. Isn't she darling? I, she's one of my favorites on CMO. CMO is one of my favorite Tokidoki Jujube collaborations. I absolutely love it. So in here, I just have a pacifier for my youngest who is almost a year and a half now. He's 16 months. Um, so in here, I just have a Web and Up pacifier. And then I will just kind of pull everything out and show you what I have packed in here. There's two pockets on the inside of this tote, and then you have a long um, zipper pocket back there in the back. Attached over here to the key leash, I actually just have my keys. And then I have a little custom EOS holder in that same um, CMO print. And in here I actually have my pill case and a couple of hair ties for my daughter and I. I've been using this as um, kind of a keychain to go on my keys so that I have my little pouch with me all the time. So I put little kind of odds and ends, things like I, you know, like my pill case and my hair ties, things that I might need if I'm just kind of quickly grabbing my keys and going. So that's what's attached to the leash. Um, then starting over here on the far left, I have a quicklet. And inside this quicklet, I have all of my mommy things. So I have anything in here from my um, posh sticks that I like, any type of makeup. I also have a posh um, lip scrub in here. I have my cuticle cream. I love this. I actually just posted on one of my posh pages how much I liked that. So that's been going with me lately. I have some gum. I have some of these scope sticks in here. I'm not going to pull everything out. Um, I have a bunch of lip products in there. I have my It Girl perfume roller and some um, face setting spray. So it's just kind of all of my mommy things are nicely tucked down in that quick lit. A couple more hair ties down there. Um, then right next to it, I have a Jujube um, Samal set piece in, again, this same print. And in here, I just have a couple of coupons and receipts, things that I've been keeping kind of on the go with me. Um, so that's just kind of what's tucked in there. Nothing exciting. Then I have my Kate Spade wallet. This is a full-size zip wallet, and this color is Fresh Air, I believe. I just recently got this wallet. This is one of my favorite Kate Spade wallets. I have three of them now in um, different colors, of course. So this one has been um, one of my go-to ones as far as the structure. I, I need to actually review this one because it, it is a favorite of mine. And then um, right here sitting up tall is my Swell water bottle. This is the 17 ounce one, so this is the medium size. You could probably fit the larger one in here, I'm not for sure. I did actually order one so I can do a kind of comparison of these later on when they all come in, but I've been loving this water bottle. It's perfect for summer, so that fits nicely in there. Um, I also have my iPad uh, mini in there. 
a uh, booty pod with um, a booty pod cover with my wet ones in here. And this print is the Royal Envy print. I like how it matches CMO also. And then kind of tucked down here, I just have a small Aiden and I's muzzy blanket. Like kind of a little lovey or burp cloth if needed. Then I have a quick in here. And inside the quick is everything I need for baby as far as some wipes, a change of clothes, disposable um, change mat, a little wet bag down in there, my posh healer tin, that is kind of my diaper rash tin, diapers, so this is everything I need kind of to change baby, some socks, there's a little toy tucked in here, so it's like my go-to diapering quick. Then the last um, piece that I have in here, which I'll actually leave till last so the bag doesn't kind of collapse over, is a Jujube fuel cell. And those of you that watch my videos know that I absolutely love bags that I can pack a fuel cell in. And then I have my little snack um, fob there on top. But I want to kind of show you what else is in these back pockets, like I said before, it collapsed, collapse on me. This is a uh, 31 clear pocketed tote, which I have some toys in here for the kids and a bunch of arts and crafts stuff. It's kind of like a busy bag for them. And then I have just some cash um, tucked in that little pocket down here um, inside the bag. And then in the zipper back here, I'm actually using it as my little med kit area. I have some tissues. I have a bunch of just travel size. I have my Posh Purifier stick. Um, some Neosporin to go and off stick. I have a little kid's sunscreen stick. What else is in here? Um, my Posh Healer stick and Benadryl. And then there is, I don't think there's anything else, nothing in the big part. Inside the zip pocket, you have two little slit pockets. I'm not sure if you can see there on the camera. In this one here, I have a, um, if I can get it out, it's kind of a tight fit with one hand. Um, I have a coin purse back in this pocket. And in this coin purse, I actually have a bunch of small first aid type things. Kind of a tight fit in here. Um, in here, I just have band-aids and um, antiseptic wipes, shout to go wipes, just little kind of paper type things. I have some travel scissors and some nail clippers in there also. And then in this next little slip pocket right next to it, it's actually, again, another tight fit. I just have my Lancome Dual Finish Compact back there. In these front two pockets on the inside of the bag, I have my um, little pen and my iPhone 6 Plus, so that fits perfectly inside that pocket. And then I have my Posh Hand Cream that I don't go anywhere without. This one is the Shameless Flirt scent. I've been liking that one. And I have my Honest Company Hand Sanitizer Spray and then my um, Posh Mega Lip Plumper. That is my favorite lip product for summer. I've been loving it. And then nothing else in those two pockets, kind of give you another view of where they're at. So the only thing left inside the bag now at this point is my fuel cell. And in here I keep tons of snacks for the kids. It's actually a little on the light side. We've been eating some of them. And um, I will usually throw a bottle in here for my son also. In the top here I just have some disposable placemats, some dapple wipes, some um, hand sanitizing wipes. And then I just have a bunch of snacks. I have a Kind Bar for me. This one's my favorite, the almond coconut. I love it. I just have some Ritz crackers. I have a couple of these straws in here that I've actually picked up at Target that they love. They um, have different flavors. This one has some strawberry and some chocolate in it. I kind of mixed two of the packs together. But they're really cool because they can kind of mix them in their milk when they're out eating. And they kind of give a little flavor to the milk. So they're these are super cool little straws for those of you that haven't seen them. So kind of gives a little treat for them. And then again, just a bunch more snacks in here. There's some cookies and uh, graham crackers, a couple of these apple squeeze, um, uh, apple strawberry, apple sauces, and then a couple packs of yogurt raisins in there. So it's just kind of a go-to snack bag for them for when we're out. So I'll give you a quick view now of the inside of the bag with nothing in it. It's just like I said, one big open tote that's super soft and it's squishy and it's comfy and it's easy. So it is definitely one of my go-tos for the summer for sure. I super love it. So hope you guys enjoyed that review. If you have any questions or comments on it, um, feel free to leave them below and I will talk to you soon.